As long as man will be the it does destroyer of other living beings, he will not find love or peace. Indeed, who say to so the sage of see of hate and that will not find love or peace. Man claims to be the noble animal. The species Homo ridiculous claims to know right from wrong. If one come the day that are proof of the excellent. Stop playing lip service. Stop infuriating the victims. What do your words make for difference? Absolute nothing to the victims. Your praise to Syria or another place that don't change their lives. You saying that you want that animal agriculture uh, stop but you still eating animal products just make the world not a better place stop playing lip service go vegan make your excuse make a plea go vegan and help to stop world hunger help to stop uh, all the climate problems on this planet do something for change instead of being a person without fire but only a person who live for success we are also less important than phytoplankton phytoplankton can live without us we cannot live without them they produce 70 percent of all the oxygen on earth without that we are dying and guess what they are disappearing since 90s 50. Just like the time that fish stocks are going up, that people are starting to eat more fish. How stupid are you not being to not see the connection between fishing and the decline of populations of uh, whales? Just like in the time, the consumption of animal products uh, from land animals go up. How stupid are you, people? I'm not rude, I'm not arrogant, I just present the facts. And if you don't can handle that, maybe then the problem is not with me, but then the problem is with you. I am absolutely not a social situation expert. I'm not a politician, I don't sell you stuff. I'm not a salesman. I'm an activist. And I don't also be not afraid to hurt people's precious little egos. For example, bees are also far more important than we are. And we kill the bees off. Do we know that in old times Bees keepers have steal 50% of the bees' honey. Today, there's still 100% of the honey of the bees, of their vomit, that they are used for isolation of their hives and for feed for their youngs. And replace it with high corn, a high fructose corn syrup. And the bees are dying off. If you ask me, you don't have to be Einstein to figure out what kills the bees off. The beekeepers! If you ask me. They also kill off their hives that are half uh, around the winter because it costs less to get a new hive than let the hive live for the whole winter. This is what the most uh, commercial beekeepers do. You cannot speak about that. Uh, for a uh, hobby in this uh, in curse are our beekeepers 
But that's what the majority of the um, commercial do. Check out my video about bees. If you want to know more about it. First as well so now about uh but yeah. Bees and other pollinators are disappearing. Um, because of the all the toxic stuff we put in the in nature, all the pesticides and all the antibiotics, and therefore the population of insects are decreasing. Is one of the reasons. It's also one of the reasons um, that we are destroying our complete habitats of uh, lands, habitats for lands, or how you want to call it, uh, of animals. I consider the rainforest actually territory of the animals that live there. Gorillas, um, chimps, etc. They are the true owners of that land, if you ask me. We are just... It are just a bunch of arrogant parasites who take their lands. We are like that extremely annoying neighbor uh, how take Parts and parts and year from our from our grounds, which we don't have the power to stand up against that neighbor because he is have more political power and he is more I is stronger than us, and therefore we let it go and no go, and then on one day we cannot even go out of our house because he have still all our lands around our house. That's the kind of fuckwits we are being to the animals. I don't try to even to be nice anymore. Today I've been so frustrated because of the apathy of the people. The apathy of the people is what all create all terror on the planet. People don't know want to hear, don't want to see, don't want to know. No, the true. Because it is too hard for their frail little egos, for their self-righteous perception of themselves. I say, evolve, grow up, stop being such pretentious little <sighs> networks. With pretentious little kids, well, as I before I see the truth. Or the pretentious little child must I be have to have be before I understand the truth of the ecological problem of this world. What a pretentious little being was I before I understand that you always have to protect the victims and not the oppressors. Bees. Without bees and other pollinators, we will have no, and I repeat, no, we have close to no food on this planet. Without us, anything will flourish. Anything. The oceans clean up. The seas, indeed, the skies will clean up. Very forest can recover because that's what the world do. World is a if you give it a chance, they will clean up. They will recover himself. They will install himself. It is a self-correcting system. But if you put so much toxic in the ecosystem, he don't get a chance to recover from the damage that one species have done to it. Since the ecological insanity, or must I say, 
since the start of the Industrial Revolution, we are being more destructive and more hideous and arrogant than ever before. Yes, before we also uh, kill each other for stupid reasons. Which would cause less environmental damage. Consumption of animal products was far lower. So, open your eyes and see what has happened on this planet. Being aware, instead of unconscious automatons, how to do what they are, are being told. Government, you are not justice. No matter how much you want to scream and yell like a pretentious little overprivileged child that you are no right from wrong, that you are good, that you are nice, decent and not a savage sister. You are wrong. And I'm right. And if you claim that you are right and I'm wrong, I like to debate all of you. One thing to note, in this debate, I will not hold back. When darkness and light become one, the reality splintered away and the truth become visible.